Now, your Storm Tracker 13 forecast first. Sponsored by Conway Medical Center. Nice weather to start the work week across the area. A few showers here or there. Viper 13 real time radar showing a few of them close to the coast with a sea breeze. But most of us have stayed dry throughout the area today and not nearly as hot as it was over the weekend. Temperatures right now in the 80s to around 90 degrees. We will see the moisture increasing overnight tonight and rain chances will be going up. Our forecast becoming mostly cloudy tonight with showers and thunderstorms continuing through the day tomorrow. I'll have a look at a wet forecast coming up in a few more minutes. Coverage you can count on at 5 starts now. Right now at 5 o'clock, flight cancellations and delays leave flyers stranded in Myrtle Beach. Manny Martinez has reaction from them in a live report. And breaking as we come on air, South Carolina Senator Lindsey Graham tests positive for coronavirus even after getting vaccinated. We have the details for you at 5. And later tonight on News 13 at 5.30 as the school year begins, state health officials say parents may be missing a key safety measure, keeping up with their kids' annual shots. We are so glad to have you with us for News 13 at 5. I'm Megan Miller. Bob has the evening off. Top of your headlines this Monday, some major headaches today for some flyers traveling out of Myrtle Beach. We told you that airport is already busy, but Spirit flights at MYR and also elsewhere are being delayed and outright canceled. The airline says weather and operational challenges are to blame. News 13's Manny Martinez is live at the airport with the big frustration stuck passengers are still feeling at this hour. Good evening, Manny.